Yo, what's going on guys? It's Endgirls 967 back here with another video, and today we are back with part two of Hogwarts Legacy. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the first part, and I hope you guys continue to watch and enjoy the rest of the parts, including this one. Leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good shit. Let's just hop right into it. I want to pause. Fuck. Good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? ceremonies over there were complications complications it seems the goblin Enough. problems it's like no time for rumors big and i'm rapidly losing whatever patience i had left if you're lucky we might still be able to get you sorted this evening <clears throat> i'll be in touch Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. All right, here we go. I think I know which one it is, actually. Just because of the, the Wizarding app. <laughs> Wizarding World app, I should say. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? come here with preferences and preconceptions certain expectations all right hold on um, well actually I can't wait to start classes I can't wait to explore uh, let's say start classes I'm looking forward to meeting my professors and learning all I can at Hogwarts indeed Hogwarts has much to offer a dedicated student and what you learn in class will prepare you for challenges outside the classroom as well mm. I wonder mm. I detect something in you a certain sense of mm. what is it Daring, curiosity, loyalty, ambition. Let's be ambitious. Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Mm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition. An eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. Yeah, I knew it was going to be Slytherin because it's a uh, wizarding app. Uh, Slytherin house, no for cunning, ambition, and hunger for power. Except house. I'm going to accept it. I'm not no bitch. What the fuck is he talking about? You belong in Slytherin! More of a Gryffindor guy, myself, rather than a Hufflepuff, or uh, what's the other one? 
I forgot. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. <laughs> Enough. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. Have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Actually, let me explore a little bit. Oh, shit. I just scored somebody's bed. Oh, never mind. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah. Call me a munch. Can, Can I go munch? Apple. I mean, what? Let me eat another apple. All right, Spice, you see the way I munch? Can I go munch? They're hating on me. They don't want to see me succeed. Oh, damn. What the fuck? All right, that was kind of rude. Can I go around? Ooh, I can. Ha ha! Ah! Gonna take another ample. Munch, munch, munch. Hi, Ice Spice. Can I go munch? I suppose some introductions are in order. Y'all talking some hella shit. What up, Sebastian? Let's talk, my boy. Can I help you? <laughs> Should I hope so? You're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. <laughs> he was a friend of Professor Figs, who really joined us for the ride. Still. Impressive. <coughs> a way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Figger all right. <laughs> Professor no, Figger and I were lucky to escape with our lives. Indeed. And how did you escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. <laughs> what book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough. But not every spell you may need can be found in assigned textbooks. Yes. Are you saying some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts? Which ones? 
Seems I may have met a kindred spirit. <laughs> that is a conversation. That's a fake ass laugh. Time. It was good meeting you. Good luck today. It was relatively nice. I don't like that fake ass laugh. If you do that, you'll lose. Trust me. Is this gonna be my girlfriend or what? Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Check me. <coughs> you should have listened to me. Ah, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills in a broom are legendary. You see, I could be a cocky motherfucker and say we had a handle, but Perhaps let me talk my talk. friend would have survived if we'd had your help. Precisely. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Huh. Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. There's nothing Damn. like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so She obvious, doesn't sound British, she sounds more Scottish. Goodbye, Amelda. Nice meeting you. <coughs> Ominous. Ominous, however the fuck you say it. Let's see. Alright, my boy. I, I think I heard one. <laughs> Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gorn. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. I'd much rather have arrived on time and without a dragon attack en route. I'm sure. How horrible. I can only imagine. Well, it's good to have you instead. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here. I'm just trying to be a nice guy for the first couple of days, you know? Were you expecting to be sourced in together? <laughs> Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Not something I'm especially proud of, man. He was obsessed with blood status, a pure blood maniac. Unfortunately, most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. Mm. Did that student say he thought he heard? He's a muggle hater. <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Alright, that's the end of our conversation with you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. Guys, we're all actually pretty nice, relatively speaking. What the? Oh, hello. I trust you're ready for your I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. I believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of <laughs> when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Oh. Here you are. Well, okay then. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning. 
time so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor. But what do you mean if you track a lot of life? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. Do keep up. Okay, before we continue, I just want to say that during like the exploration and shit and like the cutscenes, I'm not gonna have my, my face cam on. But like during like the action and shit, I'm gonna put the face cam on, alright? Uh, there's an eyeball in the chest. I'm scared. Oh, not that one. No, nope, not that one. There we go. Interesting. Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that. Inside and outside of the castle. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around. Okay. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Oh. So like the grand staircase? Oh, okay. And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Up or down? You can it does not matter. Anywhere in the castle, quickly from Central Hall. Always oh, something happening here. It's the heart of the hive, our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become wars. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Heckert in charge of our students' education in that regard. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain, and is home to an array of shops and shops. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Okay. What will I learn in the okay. class? Exactly what you might expect. Spell, charm, genius, all terribly useful. I think you'll enjoy Professor Rowan. He's a clever, entertaining wizard. <coughs> Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of the Velio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. We did take a bit of a detour on the way. Explore? No! Did I accidentally skip? Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I accidentally pressed skip, I'm so sorry. Ah, 
I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare <laughs> aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and cats, Mr. Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade. No surprise. All right. Okay. Just talk to him. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today, before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. All right, guys, actually, as I was editing this, I decided to end this part right here, and uh, I didn't upload on Sunday because it was Super Bowl Sunday. Who, who wants to compete with the Super Bowl? So, uh, yeah, this is going to be end of part two, three. I already forgot now, but... Uh, yeah, hope you guys like, comment, subscribe, share, do all that good shit, subscribe, I forgot to say that, I think, but yeah, without any further ado, this is Enemy Austin 97 signing out, peace.